rent were on the ground at the coast of the road as asphalting was ongoing even under the rain, an indication that probably suggests that the contractor is in for serious business. Residents of a coast of the community who could not hide their joy because of the road construction commended the Edo State Governor Mr. Godwin Obaseki. They said after many years of hardship because of the bad condition of the road, the state government has commenced the repair of the road. As uh, Obasek is, is walking towards, we thank him. We pray unto him that he should be long life and prosperity. You see, we can see governor. And we thank him. I bless him. May God lead you to anywhere. I want to really appreciate God because we've witnessed this road three times or four being abandoned. And this is the first time we've seen the road, not just at the beginning point, but we've seen it at this level. Before this time, from Ukbawa, this is the code of the road, down to the code of the uh, uh, gate by uh, Uniben, it was almost like somebody that is traveling between Morocco and Spain. Those contractors, the way they are working is showing that these people are ready to do this job. According to the project supervisor Tunde Egwaroje, who said the project consists of some adjoining streets and side drains, assured the road project will be completed soon. The project started a few months ago and they will be able to achieve 1.5 kilometers asphalt. In the next two or three weeks, we will complete the other adjoining road asphalt. So the road in Obia Northeast local government area for those states is one major road that leads to the University of Chile. And for decades, the road has been in a very bad state until this present intervention, where the road is now being asphalted. Residents in the community are hopeful that the contractor handling this project will complete it on schedule in order to ameliorate the plight of motorists and other road users lying this road. From Benin, West Ndiere, 